I think this is it. These are the trainers. My intuition was correct. Let's see if they'll talk to me. Whoa. Really? Really, guys? Right. First, let's let's drink some some of this. We. Second. Whew. Let's leave. I'm pretty certain that they can't follow. Now let's buff ourselves up. And that's how it works best. Yeah, and then we'll get right back in and kick their ass. Yeah, scream, motherfucker, scream. Oomph, motherfucker, oomph. Arm me on with your ebony longsword, which I'll take because it's extremely expensive. Oh, this guy is even more armored than the other guy. And he hit me. At least he's not as fast as the other guy. Right. You cannot repair items during battle? Then what am I supposed to do? Uh, what are these? Oh, I bought them because they have like fortified speed. And uh, nothing else seems to have it. Uh, let's drink that Sajama. Right, motherfucker. It's time to taste some serious, serious strength. I was gonna say, but well, yes, you, 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 you know better. Right, 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 right. right. Uh, yeah, I do want that to jump against that second guy because he he seems like he's extremely powerful. Okay, I'm gonna need more than just a potion. These guys are serious business, so give me this plus. Uh, no, not the Philosopher's Stone. We're not that quite, quite that desperate yet. I've also tested the Philosopher's Stone and it doesn't work if you get killed instantly. Which is the most common occurrence, I believe, that's gonna happen in this scenario. Alright, so first of all, let's, let's, let's go, as they say, Kaioken 2, right? If one set of potions doesn't work, how about two? It's reserved for people like that motherfucker. Thinks, uh, oh yeah, yeah, you know what I'll do? I'll just kick your ass. No, you won't. This is the ultimate technique. Besides the actual ultimate technique of drinking super overpowered potions. Look at that. Ah! Jesus. Ebony war axe. <laughs> Yank. Orcish crap. That was just orcish? Man. Yeah, I have even double potions of speed. Great. Inspirations. I was hoping for like a skill book or something. It's becoming very difficult to control myself and see what's happening because there's double the potion. Oh, you think I can't unlock this? You haven't seen me work. There we go. Extreme luck is at my side. Also, since we're let's 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 just make sure that we're ready for whatever's up there. Also, my uh, what you call it? Almost ready. 
Wow. Even my sneezing is quite expeditious. Let's, let's put it that way. Jeez. Well. Yeah. That iron shield looks like it's magical because of how it's placed. You stand no chance against me now. Mere peons, at least for the next minute or so, while this is at 1000. Corpse of a lost sailor. Well, that doesn't seem impressive. It's just a bunch of crap. Diary of a Lost Sailor. Okay, there we go. Oh dear, that's a lot. <laughs> Day one. My crew and I were caught in a fierce storm just outside Ebonheart. We managed to make it to safety by digging ourselves into the fucking ground or something, but are now completely lost. Without a cargo or a ship, there isn't much we can do. I will try to find passage for us somewhere. We are unarmed and ill-equipped to defend ourselves. Hopefully someone will take pity on us. The crew is waiting on the shore for my return. Two days later. I am confident I will find a village inland that will have access to a ship. I think I see smoke off in the distance. Maybe tomorrow will bring a change of luck. Four days later. Those cursed villagers made our fields dry up and their children suffer. They have steered me completely in the wrong direction. I firmly believe I am going further and further inland. If I don't see a fishing village soon, I will be forced to turn back. I have been subsidi sub subsiding? subsiding on roots and grasses and grow weaker every day. I must find a way for my crew and I to get home. Boiled my shoes to make broth. I had, I had heard it would work. It didn't. Now I have no shoes and a stomach ache. Five days later. This is pointless. I've been directed to a fishing village to the east, but so far I've seen or heard nothing. Killed a rat today. It was the most food I have eaten in days. Tastes worse than a squib jelly, but better than shoes. Well, at least my shoes. Next day. From my vantage point in a tall tree, I finally see a town. While I do not see any sign of water, it does look to be a fairly sizable town and may have a trade route to the sea. I should reach it tomorrow. Next week. Lost. All is lost. I have once again been misled. After entering the town, I came across a man who offered to help. Weak from hunger and exhaustion, I believed him and followed him underground to his home. They have a massive underground system of tunnels and old sewers here. It's really quite amazing. Unfortunately, I seem to have made a rude comment about his sister being smoldering and he beat me senseless? Huh. Probably shouldn't have made that comment. When I awoke, I was in this pit with no way out of inside. I can see up to the floor above, but no one responds to my cries for help. I fear I will end my days here. Oh, why did I ever leave my crew? They must be giving up hope now, as am I. Five days later. Woke up to hear noises of construction from the floor above. Ran to the opening and cried out. It was to no avail, however. Instead, it tossed down the most horrible creature. It is rank and ugly and eyes me in the most vicious way. I have retreated to this corner and await my doom. It will get hungry soon and I fear it sees me as its only source of food. I am too weak to defend myself. This will be my last entry if someone finds my bones. Bury me facing the sea wherever that may be. Oh dude. That, that's really bad. Okay. Let's, let's take some of his bones with us. I hope I, I hope I yeah okay we we have his bones we'll, we'll take it to the sea. It's the last wish. Okay, I think. Oh, we're still super duper overpowered. Right. Where are these two? I don't remember these. Unless. This is under that other building, then. 
There's no actual way upstairs, but this is the underground bit of the other building. Okay. Let's go. Do a speed run. I think we've killed everything now. Officially. You sons of a bitches. Alright. That way is absolutely nothing. Alright, that leaves just the ancient best tray. Also, I've killed both of the ultimate trainers, so that's nice. What the hell? Someone grow a fucking wall in front of me? That's some dedication if that was the case. Alright. Potion's gonna run out soon. We best hurry up. Yeah, one one set has run out already. The other will follow soon. Thankfully, I'm still quite strong, even like that. Rats. Yeah. Why do you have two shields? These goblins are weird. It looks like a, like a, like a place I can go. Yeah, there we go. Chest with some bedware and stuff. Some empty crates. What a pointless place! Just for it, I'm gonna go make everybody perish. That no, that guy went back. Oh, that guy noticed me. Oh, my potions ran out. Let's go, motherfucker. This is ridiculous. Shouldn't be able to harm me, so... I'm right up in your face. What are you gonna do about it? Give me more moon sugar. I will go into potions. Okay. Back to battlefield. Where is this? Oh. Well, the way up here. How do we get down? I mean, even as a ninja, I'd probably die from a fall like this. Maybe if I aim for those pillars, I'll be fine. <laughs> Come on! Oh yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Alright, let's leave. This started off fairly impossibly, but the fuck? When did I fucking miss you? Let's get out of here. Did you start respawning? It's too soon. I ain't shield, eh? I don't have those. Mine's better, I'm sure. This is literally just one guy. Yeah. Wow. Well, the goblins are taken care of. That's great. News, right? Sorta. We're back to palace sewers. Right. Let's go. And there we go. I think, uh... Yeah, we can leave through here by going to the right. Uh, yes. And there we go. Phew! That was quite the adventure, if I were to say so myself. But we made it. Alright, so I should report to the temple, I guess. Let's see what they have to say for themselves. Hmm? 
What's the status with the goblin army? Have you taken care of it yet? You've killed the war chiefs and their ultimate trainers, and you live to tell the tale. Interesting and surprising. Perhaps I've underestimated you, good like. Rest assured, it won't happen again. Take this as a token of our lady's appreciation. Well done. Well, thank you. That was interesting. It's you again. I suppose you wish to be of further service to our lady. Well, I guess, since Baron Zaya asked me to. Like, I have not many options. I read up a little bit about this, and I do know you get to enter something at some point and kill Elmalexia. I'm not so sure about the king, but we'll see. I, I, I don't think I've spoiled myself of anything yet. Like, I still don't know for sure about the king. But I know you can kill the god here. And you probably should if the rumors are true. Hmm, I have nothing for you at this time. Speak with Gavas Drin, the Lord Arcanon. He's basically a cannon with, with just big wings. He was in consultation with Lady Elmalexia this very morning. Perhaps he has something for you. He's most likely in his office here at the temple. Go there if you wish to speak to him. That's probably this way. Yep. Yes. You're not a guy. Just as Step seems. aside before I fucking. Ah! <laughs> I am victorious. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Hmm. <laughs> yes. You are the one that Lair mentioned. Interesting. You are to be of service to Our Lady. It is essential, and all would be displeased where uh, you to fail. All would be displeased. All, I say. Right. Beneath this temple there is a large, large sewer system built around the ruins of old Mournhold. You smell like you may have spent some time there. Regardless, in these ruins there lies a shrine. The Corrupted Shrine. It's the Shrine of the Dead, which was once a place of great power. It served as a channel to the ancestors, allowing the faithful to learn from them to harness their power. Over the years it has been forgotten and has grown sour. The power of that radiates from the Shrine has drawn hordes of the undead to it. The Shrine of the Dead must be cleansed. No, no, certainly not by you. This tax falls to one of Almalex is chosen. You will escort this young priest, Arvil Delny, to the shrine. Protect him well, good like. His experience is limited, but he is necessary to complete the ritual. The shrine is protected by the profane, powerful liches who feed from the power of the shrine. You must destroy them for Delny to perform his duties. I stress again, protect Delny at all costs. It is he who must perform the ceremony. If he is not able, there are no others. Okay, dude. Follow me! Oh my. Goddess, protect me. No, Goddess is, Goddess is staying in her chambers. You're coming with me. Hello, I'm told you will accompany me to the Shrine of the Dead and protect me as we travel together? Well, our lady commands it, so I suppose we must go. Stay with me. Come here, fool. Oh, goodness me. This is gonna be one of those... long and arduous battles, isn't it? Uh, 